So I put the flex disc into the microscope, a good size one. And you see this is the top structure. And if I move the objective by that way, then the top structure gets out of focus and the bottom structure of the textured size gets into focus. If I turn even more, and then the bottom structure also gets out of focus. So this is a way to determine the, the height of the structure. And this is about half a turn on my microscope. And it says it's 40 digits and from 100. So by 40%, a 40% dial count. And this is a, well, yes, it's a Carl size microscope, the standard one. I will show it to you quickly after this uh, demonstration. And so uh, this can be done. So now we can calculate the, the height of the structure. And you see that there is not really something special about the structure. It's not something really made artificially. So maybe it's just <laughs> some side effect of some other plexiglass material, I don't know. So you see, this is 40, the objective is 40 resolution, so here's a 10. I think this is a 10 one. Oh, where are we? No, this was a 100. This is a 10. But think 40 is the best way to see. To me, it doesn't really look like uh, art especially made for 3D printing. Okay, what well, the 40? See, now everything is blurred. Now the bottom structure is in focus. And well, here is also the top structure gets lost. Yes. Oops. Yeah, that was my first print with a M3D and it's a PLA. So first I was very happy. And here's the microscope. <laughs> Oops. So it's what I said here is, I don't get into focus now, so if I turn here and it goes up, up and down. So. Well, I'm not really happy. <laughs> this is plates. Because I bought them to, to print ABS and, and not to print PLA because PLA, uh, I could print um, already. Okay, bye-bye.